In this video, we look at the twos complement method of representing negative binary integers. Imagine a car's milometer. A car leaves the factory with all digits on its milometer set to zero. If we were to drive the car for a mile, we would end up with 000, 000, 000, 001 on the meter. We could think of this as positive or plus one mile. Imagine if we could turn the meter back one mile, we'd get 999, 999. We could think of this as minus one mile. Computers can use a similar concept. Here are the decimal numbers from minus three to positive three represented in two's complement binary. We can see that positive numbers always start with a zero and negative numbers always start with a one. When using the two's complement method, the leftmost bit known as the most significant bit or MSB represents a negative value. So in this case, negative 128. Let's start by representing the positive number 117. Well, firstly, it's a positive number. So we put a zero in the most significant bit. This is the sign bit. Remember, zero is positive. If we put a one here, we'd have negative 128. We then place a one in each of the columns required to get to 117. So a 64 plus a 32 plus a 16 plus a 4 plus a 1. Positive 117. Now let's try representing the negative number. So negative 117. Well, it's a negative number, so we must start with a 1. Currently, we've got the number minus 128, as we've got 1 in the column that has a weighting of minus 128. We now put 1s in any columns we need to bring the number up to negative 117. So we've put a 1 in the 8 column, so we've gone from negative 128 to negative 120. We put a 1 in the 2 column. Now we've gone up from negative 120 to negative 118. And finally, we put a 1 in the 1 column. We've brought the number up from negative 118 to negative 117. Now there is a simple method you can follow to easily turn a positive binary number into its negative two's complement version. You follow three steps. One, write out the positive version of the number. Two, starting from the right most digit, the least significant bit, copy each of the digits exactly as they appear up to and including the first one. Step three, from this point on, swap every one for a zero and every zero for a one. So let's convert plus 12 into negative 12. So write out the positive version of the number first. So that's positive 12, an 8 plus a 4. Starting from the rightmost digit, the least significant bit, copy every number exactly as it appears up to and including the first one. So those three digits have been copied exactly. And then from that point on, flip them. Ones become zeros and zeros become ones. We now have the negative version of positive 12. So finally, let's go over a worked example of binary subtraction. So let's do 73 minus 106. Now we're in two's complement, so our most significant bit has a negative weighting, negative 128. The easiest way of performing subtraction is to turn the number we want to subtract into its negative version and then add the two numbers together using normal binary addition. So we're going to turn 106 into negative 106 and then perform the following addition, 73 plus negative 106. 
So we've written out 73 and we've written out 106 and we're quite familiar now with how to do that. We turn 106 into its negative version. So we copy each digit out, starting with the least significant bit up to and including the first one. Then we swap all the others over. We've now got the negative version of 106. We can now ignore that middle line. We don't need that now. And now we can perform standard addition, like we taught you in the previous video. We're just going to add the two numbers on the screen together. 1 plus 0 is 1. 0 and 1 is 1. 0 and 1 is 1. 1 and 0 is 1. 0 and 1 is 1. 0 and 0 is 0. 1 and 0 is 1. 0 and 1 is 1. We now have the number minus 33. That's a negative 128 plus 64 plus 16 plus 8 plus 4 plus 2 plus 1. Negative 33. Or in other words, the original equation 73 minus 106. Having watched this video, you should be able to answer the following key questions. How do we represent negative numbers in binary using the 2's complement method? How do you perform subtraction using 2's complement?